the radio stations of DoorCountyDailyNews.com with some great local business news in Sturgeon Bay, Dennis Anschutz and Misty Torp at 210 Madison Avenue. What's the news, guys? We're moving the barbershop. <laughs> the razor's edge the is razor's moving edge. 300 yards up the street. Absolutely. So it's official. Yes. When did you purchase? When did you buy? Um, we purchased it a few weeks ago, but we will not be moving for a year yet. Okay, so when is the estimated open date of the new location? Next July. Next July. Yep. All right. Dennis, how many years at the old spot? 43 years. Woo! It's going to be a big change for me. That's a long time, boy. Yes, yes it is. So what will you miss most about the old location? Oh, I had a great landlord. I mean, Lori's been really great all the years that I worked with her. And, uh, you know, I like I said, I've been going to the same spot for 43 years. It's going to be a change. And what were you most excited about the new location? Everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love the windows, the open yes. concept. What do you plan on doing? Keeping some of the similar open area? Keep it all open. Let people walk by, see what's going on inside. Maybe expand it. a little bit, have a couple more chairs in here, bring a couple barbers in. So you are looking to add some people? Yes. All right. Well, let's take a little tour here. I'm going to take a look at the outside wide view first. How many more parking spots are you going to have at the new spot? A lot. We're going to go from two to about 11. Wow. All that'll right. Make, no more traffic jams. Yeah. Yep, that'll make a big difference. <laughs> so the parking, and I heard signage is going to go up on each side. Is that right, Missy? That's what we're hoping to, yep. Very cool. So this building has sat vacant, for my knowledge, for more than 13 years. It's never been open. Dennis, you're the historian. Tell us what has been in here over the years. Well, it started off as a, a Dairy King, or Dairy Queen, I should say. Dairy King. Dairy King. Uh, it was, a, uh, I think, a Tasty Freeze. Then the Rascals had it for a while. Hmm. That was uh, Steve Estes. Yeah. And then Kathy and Jim Olson bought it, and they ran a restaurant for a little while. But it's been empty for a long time. Awesome. Let's take a tour. Okay. So we're going to walk in the front door, and... How many setups, how many bays, how many cutting salon spots? Hoping to put four in. Okay. There's a lot of work. Well, this is a much bigger spot than where you're in now. A lot yes, more is. room. Wow. Yeah. What's the square footage? Do you know? I... Joey! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He's off camera. He's hiding over here. But, Absolutely. Uh, so you're going to have seating up front, I understand. Yeah. Okay, so the whole front wall will be seating. People can come in. Um, will you have a receptionist, do you think? Or are you going to keep the way it is? Not, we'll keep it the way it is. Okay. We'll have a reception area for sure, but. All right, and. We'll still do all the answering, all the talking. It'll be dad and I. That personal touch. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Family touch. Yep. Means a lot. All right, Dennis, so you've got a back area that's pretty big here too. You're gonna to have some room to move. It's not just gonna be chairs anymore. That's right, yeah, we'll have a lot more uh, waiting room, which is good, uh, especially if we go to four barbers, we're gonna definitely need it. I mean, there's a lot of, there's a lot of work to be done. I mean, we got to figure out minor things like phones, oh, yeah. um, coat racks, all that Where stuff. Where all the deer heads are going to go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you. That was a big question that I didn't ask yet. It's are you keeping be... your similar decor? Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. So the outdoor theme is not going away? No. no. Oh, thank goodness. It's still going to be a, a barber shop. Yep. The, way, the neighbors are already waving at you. How about that? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. So the bathroom is in the back. Yep. People are only going to enter in the front though. Is that right, Missy? Yes. Yep. Okay, we're gonna walk around this way, and if you've been in the Razor's Edge before, you know that this bathroom, just by looking at it already, is like four times the size a of the other one. A lot bigger, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Good, will you utilize the downstairs, not just for your stuff? Um, no, it'll just be <laughs> storage. junk. Okay, all right, very good. Wow, congratulations, you Thank two. You. This is very big news. Tech. Great to see Sturgeon Bay filling another empty spot. Absolutely for a long time and with Joey and Misty as the new owners of the Razor's Edge. Dennis, does this mean you signed a 20-year contract? <laughs> <laughs> at you? least, at least. So we're going to keep them around. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. The Razor's Edge moving to 210 Madison Avenue with Surgeon Bay set to open for sure by next July and it may be even sooner. So stay tuned for updates and details from the Razor's Edge Barbershop with the radio stations of DoorCountyDailyNews.com.